push a bra to see my boobies, but you can't even see them. <laughs> okay. <laughs> okay, I'm ready. I'm ready. Damn. Yeah. Okay. Hi everyone, welcome back to my channel. So today I have my friend Seda with me today. Hi. So we're gonna be doing the switching our makeup routines. So I have my stuff here and then she has hers here. And so we're gonna switch and basically just do our makeup. So yeah. If you guys are interested in watching that, then just keep on watching. <laughs> so what do you do first? Like, do you do your face? Do you do your eyebrows? Oh, um, I do... What do I do first? Oh, so I have to put this on first just so okay. that it moisturizes my skin. And then I do... Okay, maybe we should take everything out. Eyebrows first. Eyebrows first? Okay. Yes. Is this what you use for your brows? Yes. <gasps> is this the Kevin on D one? Yeah. <gasps> I've never used this. Let's try it. Lit, lit, lit. Okay. So Dang, I guess we're gonna good. Go, we're gonna go with brows first. Can you just use a pencil? Yeah, I just use a pencil. Okay. You're like yikes. <laughs> <laughs> okay. So <clears throat> I'm gonna be using the Kat Von D brow pomade. This is what she uses. So I'm gonna use that. I forgot how like so anyways guys um we went to high school together we've been oh, friends I'm not even introducing you um <laughs> we've been friends huh oh okay so we've been friends since eighth grade yes eighth grade i met claire's in eighth grade and yeah we've been friends since so we're graduating now it's two years out really yeah it's been a long time honestly it feels longer though. You think so? Yeah. It's technically only been a year and a half because we, like, yeah. in five months, you know, we would have graduated two years. But like, it feels so much like longer. Like, for real. Like, we've never done anything to each other. I know. We've, or, really like, we, we've never had drama with each other either. I think we're both like, I feel like we think the same when it comes to a lot of things. Yeah. Which is good. Yeah. Because, you know, those are the type of friends that actually matter, you know? Yeah, like we can, I feel like we both can tell each other when we're fucking up and if we're not doing something that we're supposed to, or if we're doing something we're not supposed to be doing, or, you know, and we don't get offended by it. Yeah. At least I don't think so, right? No, we don't. I need to move this a little bit. Okay, so I I had read one of them earlier. Mm. I think this is, I think I'm going to leave my brows low now because now they're going to be <clears throat> Look at me extra crazy. Slow ass. Well, I kind of went ham on this one, so if I do anything else to it, I'm going to look crazy. Okay. Someone said, what's a secret you have that you haven't told the one another about? Do mm. we have any? I don't think so. I'm trying to think if I have anything that I like, that's like for real secret. I don't have any. That you've never told me? Yeah. I feel like I would tell you if anything crazy happened to me. Yeah, you always do. Me too. Yeah, when we do catch up, we kind of just say everything at once. So no secrets between us? I don't know. Is there? <laughs> I don't know. I don't know. Um, no, I don't think so. I don't think so. I can't think of anything. If there is, we'll come back to it, but I can't think of anything. Someone said, share an embarrassing story. A juicy one. A juicy one. Okay. Like what you have to you have to help me remember because I don't fucking remember anything from <coughs> high school. Like so, I literally don't remember shit. I think we can go back to the time that I crashed my car and we <gasps> were like drinking at my house after. <laughs> <laughs> Let's hope my mom doesn't watch it. But I'm pretty sure she knows it, like Yeah. So anyways, Oh my god, I forgot. So we were all it was like a bunch of us. How many were like five or six girls? I think five or six. And we were on our way to... Wait, when was this, though? What year? Were we juniors? We weren't seniors. I think this was, like, 2016. Were we sophomores? Uh, okay, I think we were sophomores. Cause I, did I still have my white car? I think so. so yeah, I mean, yeah, because <gasps> when you left, you're, like, out the window, like... Oh, wait, no, that's a different story. Oh, wait, no, no, no. That, that was... was... Bird, baby. <laughs> no, yeah. you're talking about the day we were supposed to go eat together? Yeah. Okay. Okay, <clears throat> that was like, we were, I think we were juniors. Where were we going to eat? We are going to go eat to that, where the guys, <laughs> the guys are like, you know. So there's like, oh, my thing just broke. Did so it really? Sad. Yeah. Do you have another oh, one? No, it's like, I'll do it like that, that's fine. 
Like, just take it out. Unicorn. You can just take it off. Or I'll just take it off. Okay, here, I'll just put my bobby pin. Just to hold my green. Okay. But yeah, anyways, we were gonna go eat to that place. It's like a, a guy's version of Hooter. Like, you know how at Hooters the girls were like dressed up in tiny shorts? Well, there's this place that where it's um, the opposite. Like, it's guys dressed in like Speedos. But I think most of them, I heard that they're like all gay guys. Yeah, so, that's like, what I heard. So, but we were literally on our way we there. We didn't know. Yeah, we didn't know. So we thought it was gonna be cool and everything. We were like, ah, we get to go. We were young. We were like, what, like 16, 17, maybe? Yes. We and were then, little. Yeah, so I was like driving and then I like freaking crashed, okay? And I was like, damn, like I just ruined everything. And then after that, we just went to my house and we went to go drink. No, okay, so we were like, after we went, we were gonna have like a sleepover and just like drink together or whatever. Do you use, do you mix both, both of these? Um, anyways, back to the story, we, like, completely forgot. So, anyways, we had had this plan where, like, us and all these girls that we, like, were friends with in high school. Which we were, some like, are still our friends. Okay, don't get offended. <laughs> but, I don't remember how the group, but anyways. Um, we were, our plans were, Seda's mom's super cool, so we were gonna go spend the night at her house afterwards and, like, just, like, drink together and have, like, a sleepover. And, but we wanted to go all have, we wanted to go eat first. And we were in two different cars, right? Because I was driving too. Yeah, that's how I went to go pick you up and stuff. Well, I think you guys got there before us. Oh yeah, yeah. It was me and somebody else driving up there. Yeah, yeah. yeah. So we were in two different cars because there was like probably like six of us, and we're in two different cars, right? And yep. so I'm on my way to this place so that we can all go eat there. And then I'm waiting. I'm like, hey, where y'all at? Like, we literally had just pulled up. Like, I wasn't even I hadn't even parked yet. Yep. And then you call me, you're like, I just got an accident, blah, blah. We were like, oh my God, this is God telling us that we're not supposed to be doing anything that we're doing. <laughs> and she got an accident, and you you didn't want to tell your mom or anything, right? Because you fucked up your bumper. Like, the whole fucking car was yeah, just gone. Yeah, it was, like, like total. Like, her car was gone. And then you can tell your story. So then I went to go, she told me, like, where she wrecked that. And it was kind of, like, the area that I grew up in, so, like, I knew the area. And so when she told me, I was like, okay, like, we'll go find y'all. And so I went to go find her. We picked her up. Uh, picked her and the other girls up. Right. But you can tell me um, your... Okay, so say like your side of the story or like what happened. <clears throat> so of course I was texting and driving. <laughs> I don't know. <laughs> Damn, mom's going to kill me. Um, yeah. The internet's going to come for you. I'm kidding. Yeah. <laughs> but yeah, I was texting and driving and I didn't pay attention. So the, there was like a lot of traffic and then... Um, yeah, I just fucking crashed into a truck yeah oh oh we're gonna tell you i mix this foundation to these two so like if okay. you want more coverage because this one's like it'll cover but not as much so i use that one too so yeah but yeah i just crashed you know with a chevy and then nothing happened to her truck at all whatsoever which was crazy so <laughs> it was just my no, car no that's what happened with me when i got in a really bad accident uh -huh. the car hit me it was a little car and they hit the back of my truck and their car was like smushed and i had nothing on my truck right because it was a big ass truck should have got a truck <laughs> <laughs> I know <have> bulletproof. <laughs> Everything too. Oh yeah. No. So yeah, that was pretty much it. <clears throat> and then what did we do though? How'd you go home? I forgot. Did we like okay. cancel everything? Or, yeah. Like, what did we do? I forgot. I we did, forgot. and then I called my homeboys to come pick up my my car to oh, see if they yeah. could help me. So then we drove back, and yeah, they took my car home. We were like, <laughs> her boyfriends are gonna be mad at us when they watch. Yep. Sorry. Sorry. Wow, that's crazy. Wow, this is super awesome. I like this concealer. I don't have the shade. I have the shade before this and the one after. I have 15 and 25. This is 20. Maybe I should oh, get this okay. one. That's crazy. I think that one's a little too light, but I just use it for my eyebrows. Just like yeah, the lid. I mean, it looks good though. I, this is my one of my favorite concealers like of all time. Yay. So you're doing your foundation on your forehead too, right? Mm-hmm. Okay. Yeah, I just never put a lot on my forehead because I crease so bad there. Like, I have hella wrinkles. Yeah. I have some my hair. Like, I don't know. You can only see it sometimes. So how did we meet, though? I think you... I, I had said something to you. Yeah, because I was a new girl. I didn't so know So I was anybody. like, hey. <laughs> I think it's because, like... um. All the Mexicans just were kind of friends together. And at the school that we went to, was, uh, back then it was mainly just like white white, white people. Yep. Which is fine, like whatever. But um, 
it was there was only like a handful of Mexicans that went to the school and so we kind of just all stuck together yeah <laughs> right that's kind of what happened that's honestly how and why we became friends we didn't have too many there wasn't too many of us so it's just like we um how do I say like not obligated to be friends we were like oh we have we're like alike so we can be friends kind yeah. of yeah and so that's how we became friends but I don't honestly remember I have a horrible memory as you can tell so <clears throat> I just remember child. I think we were like freaking taking no it was like the first day of school because I remember Something Joel like was that. the first one that came up to me yeah and then like I saw you and I was like ooh I was like I want to be friends with her <laughs> <laughs> so I just went up to you and I was like hey like what's your name and then you told me and then we just started talking and then we were in athletics together so then like I don't know I feel we like more did friends. we even have classes together I don't think so no, remember we? Yes, we did. We did. We had Miss Smith together. The math teacher, remember her? Ooh, yeah. <laughs> yeah, I forgot. Remember prom? Yeah. I don't think we we're allowed That's to talk so about that. Fucking though. lame. <laughs> the worst. No, what happened after? You remember? Yeah. Oh, you're kidding. That's what I'm saying. That was fucking lame. <laughs> yeah, that was so lame. I'm scared to tell that story because nobody knows. <clears throat> Maybe we should just say it. Should we? Okay. I think my mom watches my videos. They're like up it, right? Who hey, cares? Mom. She's gonna find out one day. Yeah, we're grown. Why am I scared? No, I'm kidding. My mom be tired of this. <laughs> okay, you wanna start it? Okay, so I guess pretty much after prom we were like, oh, we're gonna go to a hotel and drink and like stay there, right? So yeah, we get to the hotel and then everything just went down. Like we we were like starting to drink. And then I think I fucked it up, okay? I honestly think I did because <laughs> I went to go get some beer. And then I got off with the beer and, like, I didn't cover it or anything. I didn't think about it. So, I guess the guy was watching the cameras or something. I don't know. So, he saw it and then, like, he yeah. saw, well, he, What he saw was, like, a bunch of girls going into a room. And he only saw one guy go into the room. So, he thought that we were doing, like something something else that you know worse than what we were actually doing yeah and so um he goes and like did he say something or he said something to i don't want to say names well let's not say names other people. all right um one of our friends one of our friends <clears throat> um he said something to him like because we had we got the hotel under one of our friends names and we all just like paid and then um so he told the guy who did it for us, like, oh, you have a bunch of girls in there, like, what's going on, blah, 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 like, he went crazy. And, um, so I was the one who went with him, because I'm very, like, what, like, momish, like, I need to make sure, like, everything's under control, if not, I start freaking the F out, and I just have to know, like, what's going on. <laughs> and so I went with him, and he was just, the guy, like, who owned the hotel, or whatever, was just, like, going off and saying, y'all are doing something, y'all are supposed to have way too many people in there, like, he thought... So me and this guy friend, we acted like we were a couple and we were the ones running the hotel and we just brought everybody with us. And and so that's like what we did or whatever. And then we got in trouble, we got caught. And then the guy, my friend, who was like the one who did it with me, he went crazy because the guy told him that we he had to like um he was oh the guy was kicking us out of the hotel and he's like, You have to leave, I'm gonna call the cops blah blah. And my friend is like, Okay, give me a refund. Mm -hmm. And the guy's like, you're not getting your refund, little forgot. <laughs> so he's like, um, you're not getting your refund. And my <clears throat> friend goes off. He's pissed. So he starts like, so this hotel, like there's a glass over the, I guess I'm gonna, okay, I'm just going to say a clerk because that makes it easier. So like there's a glass over like the clerk or whatever. And then my friend's on the other side and he like banging on the window. He's like, you're not getting my money now. Like it goes crazy. And we're like, oh my God, what's going on? Oh my God, oh my God. And so then um, I'm like, I'm like scared because he's mad and this guy's going off and he's starting to call the cops. And we're all, we're all like underage or like barely 18. Well, mm -hmm. underage to drink. And so we're like scared or whatever. And we're like, crap, like, what do we do? I need to keep doing my makeup. Um, so we're like, crap, what do we do? And then he's like, y'all need to leave. No, I'm calling the cops. And so my, I told my friend, I was like, you need to leave. Like, leave now and then I'll go find you and pick you up somewhere. Like, just run and leave and then I'll pick you up because if he gets caught, like, it was over. It was going to be over for us. I says, okay, leave. And then everyone else, we told them, we told like, everyone else who was in the hotel with us that that, that was happening. Mm -hmm. So we told y'all to leave. And then someone hoed me and my other friend, not you, because you left and you got your stuff. But then this other friend who was, like, with us was supposed to hurry up and grab my stuff and take it with her. And then we were just going to leave. 
So I thought she had grabbed my stuff and then I find out she didn't. And I was like, bro, like what the heck? Like they just left my like $800 dress in this whole term because I had changed already and all of our stuff was in there. And I was like, crap, like what the heck? Like we're screwed. Like how are we gonna go back in there? Like this guy kicked us out already. Mm -hmm. And then so I made everybody leave the hotel and I was like, okay, let me talk to this guy. Like I'm gonna see if I can get my stuff back. And we left all the alcohol in there too. And I was like, crap, like we need to get it because then what if he does like catch us? There's gonna be evidence. I don't know. I was just like freaking out. Yep. And so then um, I go back and I talk to him and the guy's like, I have a daughter your age. You don't need to be hanging out with guys like that. Like he thought that was my boyfriend and was like saying all this stuff like, oh, he's such a bad influence on you. Like all this crap. And I was like, we're just friends, but okay. Like I just went along with it. I was like, yes, you're right. But like I like, was kissing his ass hard, <laughs> hard because my stuff was in there. So when I went back, I was like, I'm sorry. Like my stuff was in there. Like I really need to get it. Like I'm so sad. Like I apologize to this guy like so much mm -hmm. to get our stuff back. And he's like, okay, I'm going to give you a key, but you better bring it right back. And um, y'all need to hurry up because I am going to call the cops, blah, blah, blah. Um, and but I don't think he ended up calling the cops because of me. Like, I think he felt bad almost. Yeah. And so he didn't call the cops on us. And so we just left. And I hurried up and went in the room. And when I tell y'all, I scooped everything into my bag. <laughs> I straight up, like, there's a table with all of our stuff. And I was just, like, going it into my bag. And I was, like, trying to hurry up and run and grab my dress. And I was, like, and my guy friend who was with us. He had like a lot of jewelry on like he had like chains he had like rings like he had all this stuff and he had taken it off to like relax with us you know mm -hmm. and so i was like scooping all his jewelry and i was like oh my god oh my god and yeah. so i got it and then i take off and then i'm like i was like where are you where are you like i need to hurry up and find him because he was just walking around I was like if a cop sees him like walking around like it's gonna be the worst, worst thing ever yeah and so i pick him up and then um we drop off like our other friends and then we ended up dropping we didn't hang out afterwards did we Hell no. No, we didn't. We were all like, we need to split up and everybody just go home. Everybody just went home. And I was scared. I was like, I didn't tell my mom. Like, I didn't tell my mom we were doing any of this. Like, I told her we were staying at a friend's house. I was like, I cannot go home because then she's going to know, like, something happened. Well, I mean, now she's going to know what the hell happened. And so I, like, I go or whatever. And then we had these other guy friends who were hanging out. And they had gotten a hotel and they had already, like, figured out their situation. So it was just me and, a, and another girlfriend. And we decided to stay with them. We're like, hey, can we stay with y'all? And she was supposed to be with me. So we were like kind of together. And um, basically we were like, we need somewhere to go. Like we can't go home, blah, blah. And so our guy friends were like, yeah, just stay with us. We'll have a hotel. And there was two beds. So me and her slept on one. And the guy slept on the other. And um, that's basically what happened. Then we went to go eat at Waffle House. And then one of my ex-boyfriends showed up and like made a whole scene. And it was just like annoying. But uh, after that, it was all good. <laughs> yeah but that was a lame prom yeah it was super lame that's why like we didn't even get to have fun after prom like prom was already lame but we made it fun like we yeah. made it fun with each other and like you know but after prom it sucked because we were trying to do our own thing and not hang out with everybody that we went to high school with and just like a big group of like our friends hang out and yeah no it went to shit literally it was horrible it really did okay we're basically almost done. Just popping in some inner highlight corner. Mm -hmm. Inner highlight corner highlight. <laughs> Dude, look. I got I got a this line and my teeth are getting straight. But look, yeah. now that they're getting straight though, these, this tooth is bigger than the rest. What? So like, Which one? <laughs> look. Oh, fuck. Maybe mm -hmm. they just gotta, I think you should shave it. Probably, no. Well, I guess you could, yeah. Well, it's not done getting straight. It still has a little bit to move, but. I was thinking before, maybe like with your braces, it would pull it down. Mm -hmm. Yeah, maybe. But. Since no. I have Invisalign, I don't think that's big enough. Yeah. But I have two months yeah, left. Yeah, you can shave it. I have the rest of this month and then next month and I'll be done. So hopefully it'll like move. But now that, because before when they were like crooked, they were all kind of like the same yeah. height. But now that like. They're getting straight. That one's bigger. So did you go to the dentist to do that? Or where? Mm -mm. It's just called Small Direct Club. And you go to an office where they like take impressions of your teeth. Right. And then then they um they get like information or whatever from you. And then they send you a box with all of your trays. Wherever long you need them. Mm -hmm. And you just change them every so often. Like when it tells you to. Oh, okay. Mm -hmm. And then I'm just going to... Put some of this on. Mm -hmm. Have you tried that? Try no. That's probably yeah. gonna try it. I look weird with lip gloss. I can only wear lip gloss when I'm doing like natural days. For some reason, it looks weird on me. Really? <gasps> mm -hmm. Oh, 
smells good too. Is mm-hmm. this the Rihanna one? Mm-hmm. Yeah. Fenty Beauty. Yes. Yes, honey. So, wow. Mm-hmm. You look fucking good. Thank you too. Wow. I really like your lipsticks. Like a little bit. Oh, combo. my lipstick? Mm-hmm. I think that's it, right? Mm-hmm. Did you do bottom mascara? Mm-hmm. I did. Oh, a little okay. bit, not a lot. But I think that's it. Like, yeah, I think other than that, you look yes. pretty good. Okay, let's run this outro. The outro? Outro, outro yes. Okay. Okay, so that is it for our makeup. I hope you guys enjoyed this video, and we will see you in the next one. Bye. Bye. That's so cool. Yay, we did a video together. Now we can I do know. more.